In today's video, I bought a box of old school Yu-Gi-Oh product. What's up guys, we are back with another epic old school Yu-Gi-Oh purchase. And no, this box is not from Amazon Prime, even though it is an Amazon Prime box. So it'd be pretty cool if you could just order these off Amazon Prime, but usually you probably get. So I opened it up just to see already like what it was and confirmed what I thought it was. There are a few items in here that are pretty exciting. There's also a giveaway, so I'm just gonna get right to it. Let's open this thing up here. Let's pull out the giveaway first. This is from non X zero on Instagram. So I bought these from, so shout out to him for the awesome purchase. Well, I purchased it, but for the awesome sale, I guess. He sent us a, I didn't buy this one, by the way. He just sent this pendulum summon hordes of monsters. We have a structure deck inside. There's a mat, there's a booster pack, space time showdown power box. I've never opened this product, this full product before. So this will be really cool. And this is part of the giveaway. So if you guys wanna win everything in here, just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications. Let me know down below. What do you think about this purchase and what is your favorite item? I also included a bunch of booster packs that are mine. So we can have a little bit of an extra opening as we go. But honestly, I mean, pe I mean, pendulum. Like this is a problem here. Pendulum, okay, uh-oh, not a great start. Okay, let's open this thing up. This video is sponsored by what? Whatnot is an awesome auction platform that I'm sure you guys have heard about from me before. I currently do live auctions there pretty frequently, and we're actually doing one this Thursday at 5 p.m. Central. And we're not just auctioning off anything. We're auctioning off a first edition Magic Ruler booster box. We're going to do each pack. It's going to be very exciting. We're going to attempt to pull the Blue Eyes Toon Dragon. One of you guys could potentially get it. We'll also be giving away a bunch of different things during the stream. All you have to do is go to Whatnot and be on the stream and have an account to win those giveaways. We're also doing a Rarity Collection 2 stream coming up very, very soon when that set releases. And I have another big one planned for after that as well. So click the link below, get $15 free credit when you sign up for a new account. Type in Ruxin34 in the search bar, you go find my profile. You can save my show so you guys don't miss it. It's gonna be super fun. I hope to see you guys on Thursday at 5 p.m. Central because we're hopefully pulling that Blue Eyes Toon Dragon. Let's see what we can get out of here. Uh, I mean, it's pretty old at this point. It's crazy how old pendulums are. I mean, I think there was, what was it, 2014 when they came out, which is pretty wild, like 10 years ago. Pendulum are that old. The end of Yu-Gi-Oh is 10 years old. Okay, the back says power up your decks for any dueling showdown unlike any other. Take your game to the next level with the Space Time Showdown Power Box. Learn the new game mechanic, Pendulum Summoning. It is new. This must have came out right when it came, when Pendulum Summoning started. With the Super Starter Space Time Showdown, complete with a rubberized game match showcasing the new player field with its Pendulum Zones. As a special bonus, there's an extra randomized power-up pack included in this power-up box. Once you've mastered the deck, customize it with the power-up packs and create your own unique deck. Whether you're just starting out or already a seasoned duelist, the Super Starter Space Time Showdown will give you all you need to pendulum summon fearsome monsters and overcome your foes. With all this power at your fingertips, how can you lose? Okay, yeah, very exciting. All right, so let's open it up, see what's inside. So there is the power-up pack. So right here is a power-up pack. Very cool. Super Starter Power-Up Pack. We will open that in just a second. The mats. Let's see if I can... Oh, it's one of the half mats. These are actually pretty cool. Right here. Check that out. Very awesome. We got the Pendulum Zones and everything. Then we have Pendulum Summon now. Includes two Power-Up Packs. Oh, there are Power-Up Packs in here. I was going to say we could keep this sealed, but if there are Power-Up Packs, we definitely got to open them. Before we hop into those, let's open a couple packs. We got Power of the Elements real quick. So this is an interesting video. By the way, the old school stuff comes after this. So this is just something he sent as a bonus for you guys as a giveaway. So uh, we're going to open it up, see what's inside. I never opened this product. So very cool. Ruxin special. You get the flame body. That's a super rare right there. Okay, let's do our special starter pack real quick. All right, super starter Oh, Dark Hole. I have opened a pack of this before in the every pack opening. Uh, Dark Hole. I don't remember if it's always the same. Karaz the Light Mod. That's a good card. Injection Fairy Lily. Okay. There's some good stuff in here. Divine Wrath. And Des Volskal. That's actually a pretty good little pack right there. I think there's, you know, there's some diff different cards you can get, but most of them are very playable at the time. Okay. We'll save that for just a second. Let's put that Super Starter up there. Let's open another pack. Try to get something good real quick. Three, four. Let's try to get a Starlight Rare. We have Pit Knight Early. Melfi, Enoch, Overfusion, Mary Melfi's, Crawler, Venusliff, we have Gadget Gamer, and Scareclaw Straddle. Let's try one more and then we'll get to the starter deck and the uh, booster packs. Let's see what we can do. Can we get that Dark Magician? Can we get a Starlight Rare, Blue Eyes, Jet Dragon, the Dark Magicians, Illusion of Chaos, Dynamorphia, Teresia. There's another one somewhere. There's a fifth one. Ghost Sugar Treat. Or Chaos Nephthys. I haven't pulled this in a while. That's pretty cool. I don't think it's a very big one or anything, but very cool. All right, let's open this starter deck up. It includes the two power packs. Pendulum Summon now. I'd rather not, but okay, okay. I usually just destroy these when I open them, but maybe I can try to keep it 
somewhat intact. Actually, it kind of wants you to open it that way, like this. Literally, it's made to open like that. Interesting. I never noticed that. Oh, that actually made it easy. Okay. I usually open it like that, but I didn't know that was the right way to do it. Okay, so there's your pendulum zones. No, thank you. All right, we have Superstar to Space Time Showdown, Beginner Guide. Who wants to read about pendulums right here? Let's see what they say. So let's just go through your special summon tribute. Okay, yeah, Battle with Monsters. We got that part. Attack defense. Battle position changes. Flip summon. Spell trap cards. Where, where's the pendulum part? Not, none of that's about pendulums, I feel like. Okay, I guess that's the beginner's guide, but they don't tell you about pendulums unless I missed it. It looks like a bunch of basic stuff. Okay, let's see what's in one of these packs first. We have the power up starter pack. Ooh, the Odd Eyes Dragon. Very cool ultra. The A Forces. That's an LOD card. Swords Revealing Light, LOB card, Sacred Crane, IOC card, Mirror Force, MRD card. Bunch of old cards. So playable. You know, it makes sense why they have those. All right, time to should we go through the deck or can I just you know, let's go through the deck. Let's let's do it. I mean it's already basically open at this point. Let's uh let's see what we got inside. I've never opened this deck before. What kind of pendulum shenanigans we got going on here? We've got Time Gazer Magician, Stargazer Magician, what to Wattail Dragon, Luster, Hunter Dragon, Millennium Shield, Altar, whoa, Dark Blade, that was in the uh, How to Duel deck, uh, wait, why do I feel like none of these, I mean, I guess you can Pendulum Summon them, but they're very basic, weird, Aether, the Empowering Dragon, Ventreda, we have Arnis, the Empowered Warrior, what are these cards? Okay, a bunch of Empowered Warriors, I've never even heard of Empowered Warriors, Golden Dragon Summoner, Blue Dragon Summoner, I've heard of that from Duel Links, Red Sparrow Summoner, White Ch Tiger Summoner, Sorcerer Spell Wall. Why is this mixed in with the spells? Green Turtle Summoner, weird. I feel like that's messed up. Lightning Vortex, MST, of course. Ego Boost, Axe of Despair. Lucky Iron Axe, Monster Reincarnation, Dark Factory, Mass Production. Poison, Trapple, Sakurat's Armor, Regeki Break, Dust Tornado, Shadow Spell. Just a bunch of just staples. There's literally two Pendulum cards in the entire deck. So you literally would have to draw both of these to even make a Pendulum. There's only two. That is so strange. Okay, but I guess you can get more out of the packs, but we didn't. I mean, there's one more, but that is super weird. Okay. All right, let's try another booster pack. Very strange starter deck. <laughs> I guess like nowadays when they actually put good cards in there, that's why they're so excited. Because back in the day, it was just like, all right, two Pendulum cards and a bunch of Vanillas. And some trap staples and magic cards. It's very strange. Uh, Power Tool Braver Dragon. Okay. Nothing too crazy there. Let's do one more Battles of Chaos and we'll go for the last spell, super spell time thing. By the way, don't forget that is the giveaway. You guys can win all that stuff that we pull from the uh, little packs, uh, power packs, whatever they're called. And the mat and all that different stuff. So I'm sure some one of you guys that's uh, from Europe is going to win. And all happiness. You always do. Libromancer. Yeah, and I even make this joke, and you guys still win. You guys still find a way to win and make me pay like $20 in shipping. <laughs> Every time. It already happened. Remember when we did the monster box? Yeah, that was that was international. Don't worry. I, st I still sent it out, because that's what I do. But it was still like, can you guys give me a break every once in a while and win like some single cards so I can ship them in an envelope? Go on, we have Injection Fairy Lily. Karaz, these are very similar, and Divine Wrath, yeah, then the first pack. Okay, so that is the official giveaway has been opened. All right, now it is time for the, the moment of truth. We have four massive items we have bought today, and these will have already been up on the Patreon slash YouTube members for early access to openings, because they're going to be for sale to be opened, because you'll see why. We have a Lord of the Original Print tent, not original print, but 2002 tent, which is original print, but as you can see, very, very beat up condition but still sealed so perfect for an opening so i'm going to have this one up available for an opening to one of the patreon slash youtube members it may or may not have sold already if nobody ends up getting them you guys can hit me up and see if there's anything still available and if you want it to be open just email me or whatever and if there's something available i'll let you know but this is going to be the case with three of these items we have three tens by the way so as you can see, not great condition. Not one you would really want to keep in like display because you know it's pretty messed up, but it would be a really fun opening. It's 2002, so it has two LOB original packs, which is very cool. Two LOB original, two Metal Raiders, one Magic Ruler. So not messing around with Pharaoh's Servant or Labyrinth of Nightmare, just the first three sets, which is pretty interesting, actually. Promo is probably in terrible condition because that's how it usually happens, but if you happen to get a reverse foil or if it's in great condition, those can be worth a ton. All right, let's do a pack in between. Uh, that's the smallest of the four items, so we're ramping up right now. I have not had a 2002 tin in a long time, and I love them. They're my absolute favorite tins, the 2002 tins. They, like, they clear the, three the 2003 tins by a lot, and I like those too, but just something about the 2002s just feel incredible. 
Nordic Relic. Okay, very nice. I have an OTS 22 pack as well. Let's see if we can get something in here. You guys missed it. I opened OTS 24 the other day. Go check that out. Uh, it's pretty cool. Evo Diversity, so nothing there. Um, video up on the screen if you guys haven't seen it. All right, here's one that, uh, you know, we've had some issues with this one before. Not necessarily, this not this one specifically, but this one showed up <laughs> for us a little early. We have a Summon Skull tin. So, as you can see, similar, not in great shape. Or not as bad as probably the Lord of D, but not in great shape. I mean, look at that. That is so cool. And then, uh, you know, our, our zone on the back, we have, uh, that could be covering up something. I can't tell, no. Maybe, no, it's not, okay. Same thing, two LB, two MRD, one Magic Ruler, very, I mean, this promo is one of the coolest, which you guys remember when we pulled one out of a Blue Eyes tin randomly. <laughs> it's a Summon Skull in a Blue Eyes tin. It was pretty wild. So that is, I mean, this might be my favorite 2002 tin. I really need to get a really clean one sealed and just keep it for my display because I really just need to get all six of these. But this one, it's hard to top that one. Let's try to pull a Starlight in honor of that and try to top it. <laughs> Even a Starlight, though, is not going to be worth as much as that 10. <laughs> Even a Starlight Rare. PSA 10 of, you know, the best Starlight in this set. Which is pretty crazy. Those 10s, you know, started at, like, whatever they were. 10 bucks, 20 bucks originally, and now they're, like, really hard to get. Doom Broker, there's an Ultra Rare. I'll take that. I still have three packs left, so they're pretty they're pretty old school on these. So maybe we'll go Extreme Victory, and then we'll get into the last two items. Let's see what we can do. Open this thing up. One, two, three. It's the flippity flip on this one, so... Flippity flip, we have Kari Curry, Reboot, Clock Resonator, Six Style with Morphtronic Lantron, W Nibida Meteorite, Mech Time Blast, Psy Beast, and we have Contact with the Aqua Mirror, another fail of Extreme Victory. All right, the final 10. We've been ramping up to this moment. It fits well with the Summon Skeleton, if I can get it open. We have the 2002 Blue Eyes White Dragon 10. This one, you know, we formally pulled a Summon Skull out of one of these tins. It was pretty amazing. Uh, <laughs> instead of a Blue Eyes as a promo somehow, that was pretty weird. Hopefully that doesn't happen this time whenever we open this up. Uh, but very, very beat up. Perfect for an opening. 2002 Blue Eyes. I mean, this is... If you're going to top the Summon Skull, it's got to be this one or Dark Magician. I know a lot of people don't like this artwork as much, but I honestly do. I think it looks great. I mean, I like both the SDK and this like equally. I think they look really good. But yeah, this is a really cool item. So all of these will be available uh, or they may or may not be available once you see the video. But if you are a Patreon YouTube member, go make sure you check out the posts for stuff I have available for you guys to buy and have opened up. And there's one more item. We're gonna save it for after we open these two old school packs. So I have an original print IOC and original print Labyrinth of Nightmare. We're gonna do LON first. Cause I said we weren't messing with LON earlier, but we're going to anyway, you know, because they, they don't have them in those tins, but we're gonna open a pack to make up for it. One, two, three, four. Can we get something big like Last word from another planet, Dark Necrofear. Can we get Curse of the Mass, or the Mass Beast, not Curse of the Mass Beast, that's a comment. We could take both though, because you can get that. Can we get Revival Jam, something like that. We have Flame Dancer, Fire Sorcerer, The Gross Ghost of Fled Dreams, Lady of Salem Flames, Dragonic Attack, Spheres Lady, and we have Fire Princess. I continue to pull, is that thing centered? Time out. This thing's centering is not terrible. Usually it's really bad. It's a little tilted. Honestly, pretty nice. I keep pulling this card. It's also really clean. Okay, time out. We're going to put this thing in a PSA sub. It might be unlimited, but it's still very hard to get centered LON cards. So we'll take that. Not as bad as LOD, but still pretty hard. I mean, La I Fire Princess is not one that's easy to come by. I think I still, I mean, do I still have a PSA 10 first, Dad? I might. All right, old school cards. Let's open another foil right here, Invasion of Chaos. We got a super rare. Let's try to get a ultra rare and ultra rare. You could say right now also if you guys have not already go check out poker i'm posting two new videos coming soon new rom hack yellow legacy and another radical red video coming up soon very excited about those so go check out poker if you like pokemon challenges all right balloon lizard we have a uh, chaos greed stealth bird thing in the crater we have blazing apache zero gravity witch doctor of chaos chopman the desperate outlaw Hi -ya! very nice and Destruction ring. Okay. Yeah. Great. Destruction ring. Final item. Here we go, guys. It's like sticky bubble wrap. That's weird. One final item. This one is pretty awesome. A first edition magic ruler box. Okay. We got to open this little thing. How do you open it? All right. Finally figured it out. You just kind of pull it open. It's not It's not like one where you slide the bottom off or anything. They kind of just... Oh, that sound. First ed magic ruler this one looks pretty clean actually that's a nice box magic ruler 2002 this one is going to be open live on whatnot this thursday so you guys might have seen a whatnot 
thing in this one. This is the box we're opening up. We're going to be opening up this Thursday at 5 p.m. Central. So whenever you see this video, I think it might be Monday trying to figure out when I'm going to post this, but make sure you go to whatnot. Click the link down below. You get $15 free credit if you're a new user. Uh, go to my profile, Ruxon34. Type it in the search bar. Find me. Save this stream. We're going to be opening up this first edit Magic Ruler box. I mean, this thing looks super clean. So hopefully we can pull a Blue Eyes Toon Dragon in this one. Relinquish would be amazing. Toon Summit Skull would be amazing. Yeah, I'm super excited for this. Should be super fun. So anybody can participate. You don't have to be members or anything like that. Just hop on over to whatnot. It's going to be super cool. And of course, there'll be big giveaways and stuff like that. So if you want to just hop on, watch the stream, win some giveaways, that's what you can do at 5 p.m. Central Thursday. So that's it for our pickups. Uh, pretty awesome ones, to be honest. I mean, old school, old school. As old as you get, 2002. I love that year for Yu-Gi-Oh! And hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure you guys subscribe if you guys have not already. And I'll see you guys Thursday. And of course, tomorrow and Wednesday and every other day on the videos, of course. Shout out to Tonefo Show, Nestor Deanda, America Deutscher, KK Beats, Brandon Cheney, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Robert F., Changalang, Adelso Garcia Jr., and Edwin K. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.